to Lords. Today is the qualifying rounds for the 2012 Olympic archery event. Well, nobody knows what to expect from this athlete. Can they make it through to the final? That's the maximum, 10 points. This is arrow number two for this athlete. 9 points. Good shot. This is the final arrow of round number 1. So close to a 10. That's a 9. Here's the replay. After the first end, first place, cool as a cucumber, totally relaxed, an outstanding first round. Well, that's a strong start right in the yellow stuff. End two, arrow two. And this really is a sport where millimetres count. We're fast approaching the midway point in this competition. This is end two, arrow three. Here is the replay. End three, arrow number one. A good start required. Nine for that arrow. Second arrow. Let's add nine more to the total for that arrow. Arrow number three. It's a golden arrow, ten points. Well, let's have a look at the replay. This is Great Britain's to lose. A long way in the lead on the scoreboard. This has been a terrific performance. Well, I've been delighted with the start. This is the second arrow. In the red, not bad. This is the third arrow. Right down the middle, ten points. Lots to learn for this athlete the next time, I think. Gorgeous day at the Royal Artillery Barracks. We're outside for the next event. This is the men's skeet. No messing around there. Let's have a look on the double. Excellent, amazing, outstanding, brilliant, fantastic, phenomenal, terrific. Oh, I'm lost for words. That was amazing from Great Britain. Detonates on the single, leaving a cloud of powder in the sky. Can he follow it up with a double hit? Oh, yeah, he likes that. Two hits. Well, after that round, Great Britain continue to press on here. Here's the scoreboard. They're in second place. Gotta be right on that. Which well, didn't react fast enough to that first target. Up next, the double. Oh. Two more to the tally. He likes it. He likes it a lot. Next up, the Here's the scoreboard, Great and Great Britain in touch with the leader. They're in second place. Thunders the first one. Here we are, station four. Collects that one right out of the lower house. We're looking for the double on station four. That's two. This is the double. Locked in here. Excellent stuff. What a performance. Oh. Picked off 
the low house well. Two more targets oh. still to hit. Two for two. That was good, perfect stuff. Well, that's the end of the round, and Great Britain in pole position and miles ahead of the pack. Seemed a bit slow in moving the gun there. Now for the double, lower house first. There's no better description to this performance other than hit and miss stuff. Racking up the birds with every single Two. station. Next Heavy up. scoring. Oh. Clip that one and earns a round of applause. Final stop, oh. station number eight. Clips the target, that'll be a point. Well, the Olympic Games is all about medal. Welcome to the Royal Artillery Barracks here in the southeast of London, brought to life and rejuvenated for these games. Well, I think one of the questions about this athlete is whether or not they are actually on the road to glory. Qualifying represents the first step. Here we go, round one then. Eight seconds to hit five targets. Stop. Good stuff. Very good stuff. It doesn't matter which country you want to win the gold medal in this event. You've got to respect the start that athlete's made to this competition. Here we go, round two then. Two seconds off the clock. Same number of targets. Moved across the targets nicely there. Well, let's look at the scoreboard then after that last round, and Great Britain are in first place. So round three, six seconds to hit these targets. That's another good performance in round three. Great news for Great Britain. We've reached the midway point, and they're out in front. Well, time's cut in round four to just four seconds, less than one second a target. Stop. Well, missed out on the perfect round there. Let's have a look at the scoreboard after that round, and it makes good reading. First place. Okay. Round five, then. And now accuracy is everything. Target nicely there, it was very, very composed in round five. Sixth round, Attention. needs to shoot well here. I think he likes that. Having negotiated that hurdle to make it through to the final, this athlete becomes a genuine contender. to the Excel London for the qualifying rounds of the men's table tennis. Up next, Great Britain versus Mexico. Today, it's Great Britain. Well, the next event's ready to go, and in the commentary box for us, Alison Kerbishley. Oh, after that mistake, he really does look to the team bench for some answers. He seemed a long way out of position there. There was just no way he was going to return it. Two, zero.
Well, some great play out there on the table. He takes the point, and I'm sure he takes a lot of confidence from that as well. Two, one. Rally starting to build. There it is, the backhand shot. Pressure's really building. His opponent's error forced, and he'll take the point for that. Two. Oh, agonizing for him. Just missed out on the point there. Oh, what excitement for the crowd. This really is a game of cat and mouse here. He's trailing by only a small margin. Crowd starting to get into the game as the rally starts building. Forehand keeps the rally going. Five, two. So the rally really starting to take shape. Mesmerising stuff with the side spin there. Down low on his knees, reaches for the forehand. Written to serve. Three, five. They're piling the pressure on. They take the point. Where can they go from here? Beautiful technique with the backhand there. Well, he's starting to trail after losing that point, but it's not all lost Game at this point. point. Mexico to serve. Six, four. So the rally's starting to take shape. Keeping that ball alive on the table. Great rally. Both players really fighting for the point there, but keeping the rally alive. Well, game one complete now. Let's have a look at the scoreboard. It really could get interesting from here. Brings the backhand shot into play. Great technique on show with the backhand. Wow, this is a really long rally now. Great pressure from the other side of the table. He just wasn't up to scratch there. Oh, he loses the point. He just simply wasn't good enough there. To Two, zero. Rally starting to build. Backhand across the net. Keeps the ball alive with the backhand. Struck that beautifully on the backhand side. Forehand keeps the game in play. Well, his opponent was just simply too good for him there. And he'll lose the point. Well, we're all witnessing a fantastic game out there, but he takes the point and quite rightly. Written to serve. One, three. There we go with the side spin shot. That really is testing. That's a vicious side spin. What an incredible rally. The crowd are really loving this. Using his backhand shot. Backhand to keep the rally going. Well, after all of that, they get the point. Look what it means to them. Just places the ball with the backhand. Playing on the backhand. Slows the rally down with a side spin. Sends the ball back with side spin. Uh, that's a point lost, and he's got to be careful. He doesn't want this game to slip away from him. Well, he was simply just not good enough there, and he's going to lose the point on that one. What a shame. He's trailing here, and the difference between the two players is getting bigger. to serve. Two, six. This rally really starting to take shape now. 
Both players determined to keep that ball in play. Where on earth is the point going to come from in this rally? Well, he's really got the crowd on side now. He wins that point. Can he?